The Archdiocese of Newark announced plans to close 10 of their schools by the end of the school year. But one community said not so fast, and they rallied together to support the local Catholic school that's been in this community for six decades. Suzanne Fay has four children who attend Our Lady of Peace Catholic School in New Providence. Devastated by the news it was going to close, she quickly got to work, starting with a petition. The petition asked for an open dialogue with the Archdiocese as what we could do as a community to remain opened. Uh, we just wanted to know what were the parameters. She also started a pledge drive. So I didn't know when we started this where it would go. At the very least, I thought it would show my children that you fight for what you believe in and show the teachers who have sacrificed so much and are such wonderful educators and individuals how much they meant to us. The petition garnered 1,477 signatures, and that's not all. Uh, in two weeks' time, we had over $400,000 pledged for a three-year period. Donations coming in from all over, like from Don Murphy's business, NP Fuel, just down the road from the school. Private donors, the parishers, um, uh, business owners. I think everybody just said, hey, you know, let's keep it going. It's been here for since the 50s, and it's a great, you know, great education. And then finally, some good news. The school gets to keep its doors open with one change. It will no longer be under the wing of the archdiocese, but instead under the directive of the parish. To be told that we were being closed during a pandemic, was it felt like we were being kicked while we were down. And, and we were just devastated. And it was like the rug was pulled out from under us. So this, it's a miracle. In New Providence, Emily Young, New Jersey News Network.